Have you ever heard about the term data observability? Hello, and welcome to The Data Pinch, a series of bite-sized videos on all things data so that you can start your week with a pinch of data. So last week, my colleague Danny introduced you to the data ops methodology and mentioned that in order to put it into practice, you need to implement data monitoring and data quality processes. Well, data observability refers to both of the activities that allow you to get an overview of what's happening to your data and how healthy and non-corrupt it is. Basically, data observability includes things such as monitoring, alerts, tracking to ensure the use of reliable data. But how do you get an overview over your data pipelines? How do you observe your data? Where it's coming from, where it's going, and what's happening to it? That's where the data lineage function comes in. This function gives users a bird's eye view on everything that's happening inside your data pipelines so that you can get full observability over them. With data lineage, you can slice and dice relationship and trace back the origin of every table within your data warehouse. For example, you can easily see the different data flows, how they interconnected and detect if any pipelines are broken. The purpose of implementing data observability is to decrease and hopefully remove inaccurate data, as well as to quickly fix pipelines and dashboards with missing data. And that's a quick overview of what data observability is. Thanks for watching.